So, now we are going to study about energy. See what do you mean by energy? It is a very common word every day we use. Suppose uh, you are using your car, you are using chemical energy of petrol. When petrol burns, what happens? You know, when petrol burns on burning, what happens? It produces heat. Because of this heat energy, what happens? Now, engine is able to run. As a result, car runs. Similarly, if you take an example of a ball, if you have taken suppose like a ball like this, this ball is moving with the certain velocity v and when it hits somewhere, suppose this is a wall or something is here, when it is hitting on this wall, where its impact can be easily seen. So, you will find if it hits here and if it is soft one, you will find there the ball gets depressed over here. Why? Because this ball has energy, as it strikes the surface, it applies force and because of the force, there is a depression. So, by having energy, we can do some work. Similarly, if you have taken a ball which is raised from a ground, like this here, it is a ground and ball is raised here and this ball is allowed to fall again and again to this point, what happens? When the ball is hitting this point again and again, this point will become hot after some time. The reason is, its energy of the ball gets converted into heat energy. So, by this way also we can get something, we can do some work. Another part is here, you might have seen the wrist watches, wrist watch, toy car, toy car. In these cases, what happen? There is a key which has to be wound. As you wound the key, what happen? By wounding, uh, winding the key, we store energy and when the energy is stored inside the car and when the car is allowed to move, it moves for the certain distance. It means energy is moving the car here. So, by getting energy, we can do some work. So, now we will define what is energy actually. As I have discussed, by having energy we can do some work. So, energy is actually, it is ability to do work. So, energy is ability to do work. As we know, work is equal to force into displacement. So, we can also write here, energy is measured, energy is measured by amount of work done. So, if you have energy, you can get some work. So, SI unit of energy is joule which is the same work also has the same unit. So, SI unit of energy is joule.